Hi, hi folks, uh, I'm Padmaja uh, back on my YouTube channel and this time we will try something new with Voila. So usually uh, they build something in Flask or they build some web app in Streamlit and this time we will be trying something uh, something with Voila library and this is the site from where I have taken all the information which is uh, skyscrapers, number of skyscrapers in different countries uh, like Australia, New Zealand, Asia, um, Europe uh, so I have collected all this information this is something we will be using in today's um, uh, today's video so let's start so first I need to import some libraries such as then something like ipy widgets and then pandas and now i would be reading the collected information which says sky.csv and I'll save it in a data frame and let's see what is there in this data frame so basically these these are the name of the countries and these are number of skyscrapers in each of the countries and this is this is the data we will be using to plot the particular um, geographical map So I'll import now I would import a library called as plotly express as px and I would plot a scatter plot scatter underscore geo and the data frame would be my data frame and the locations would be data frame country because we are giving the country names and the location mode should be country it should be all small country names and hover name should be I have given as country and let me give a title to this particular plot I would say number of sky scrapers in different countries and then I would give the size of the bubbles as data frame and that would be number of skyscrapers which would be this and size of my plot I would give as 40 the default value is 20 but I wanted a bigger one and then I would say fit dot show so now I have got different skyscrapers and their uh, you know r uh, corresponding bubbles in different countries you can see so the, this is the particular map which we will be seeing in Voila so we already have an extension called as Voila if not we can even start the same with a command prompt so now we can see how this works once this is installed automatically the extension comes here so I have not saved my plot let me save this I would say skyscrapers plot if I have to run this uh, through anaconda prompt this should be the way then I would say voila and this is the name of the particular I bet the notebook sky scrapers underscore plot dot I buy the notebook and then it automatically opens in a new window yeah 
and then if I see this one I have got and I have got all these values so I can increase this I can reduce I want to select a particular area only that particular plots will be displayed here I can select that particular one all the other uh, will be disabled so this is this is a nice uh, presentation which we can give with a very simple uh, library we don't have to build anything from HTML or anything with the help of flask or something this is a very simple library very straightforward one that's it for this video thank you so much